Hello, I'm Nick Baines, a design engineer at Carblight Gyro, and today I'm going to show you one of the lab tube furnaces that we make, uh, configured with various optional extras. It's a standard 1200 degrees C tube furnace, can be set horizontal on top of the control box, but in this case it's uh, with an optional vertical stand to make, the, make it vertical orientation. It comes with a work tube package uh, and this one is set up for vacuum atmosphere. To achieve that we can supply this vacuum pump system uh, that also comes with an inert gas inlet for inert gas atmosphere. There are various controllers available with this furnace. In this case, uh, a CCT1 controller, which as an optional extra has cascade control. Uh, and that's this additional thermocouple here inside the work tube, monitoring the temperature inside the work tube. That is fed back to the controller here and used as set the target for controlling the temperature. This furnace uh, always comes with two meters of conduit uh, to connect it to the control box. So that allows various configurations, including this vertical one to be easily set up. Uh, the conduits, the one for power and one for signal, temperature signals, uh, can be detached from the control box uh, should they need to be fed through small aperture. And uh, further extension lengths are available as well. So you can, uh, have more than two meters if necessary. If the furnace is going to be mounted on top of the control box, then these detachable pieces are used to join the two together. In this case, the furnace uh, is mounted on this optional vertical kit, which comprises the stand. Uh, the furnace can be mounted at various heights on the stand. Uh, and then uh, some little bits of hardware that grip and support the work tube to set it at the right height within the furnace. So this is one of two vacuum pump systems that Carblight offers. Uh, this is the more entry-level system It consists of a two-stage rotary vein pump, which can achieve a base pressure of better than 0.1 millibar. The uh, higher level system would be a turbo pump uh, with base pressure of about 10 to the minus five millibar. We supply this Pirani gauge, which has plenty of resolution to measure down to that base pressure and beyond. Um, there's also a, a simple mechanical gauge to check that the pump is beginning to pump down. Uh, there's three vacuum valves on the system, one uh, to control the pump, one uh, here for the gas inlet, and one on top for a quick air inlet purge. Then this uh, part of the system is gas inlet. It allows you to control the inlet of an inert gas, which can be very useful for uh, repeated cycling of purge and pump down to achieve very low oxygen levels. This uh, is another modular part of the system which can be supplied without the rest of the vacuum system, just to allow a controlled inert atmosphere inside the work tube. 
So as you can see here, with this modular system that we offer at Carblight Gyro, it's possible to put together anything from a very simple furnace, uh, horizontally orientated on the control box, up to the sophisticated type of system you see here.